My name is Joy Njoku. I'm from Nigeria. And my son's name is Emmanuel Njoku. We are all from Nigeria. He is the one that is sick. In Nigeria, he was diagnosed of hole in the heart, atrial septal defect, which requires surgery. There was um, initial treatment in Nigeria about the hole, but you will find out that it could not close on its own and it requires surgery. That was how I made some contacts and we were referred to Manipal Hospital as the best hospital that can do the surgery and we have success. We are Jehovah's Witnesses and we we understand that surgeries, heart surgeries like this are done with blood transfusion. But as we are Jehovah's Witnesses, we believe that the surgery can also be done without blood transfusion. And the best place that was referred to us is in Manipa Hospital. And that was why we came to Manipa. So, coming to Manipa, my brothers here contacted the doctor. An arrangement we are made for us. They helped us to process the visa from Nigeria to India. They came to the airport to welcome us and made it easy for us to get to the hospital. The welcoming was amazing. They tried their best. They got us accommodation and they they saw to all our needs here. So, on the day of the surgery, it was a success because today I have my son. The surgery went well without blood transmission. Of course, that was our fate. The Bible says in Acts chapter 15, verse 29, that we should not eat blood. And based on that, God's instruction, I stood my ground. I said blood transfusion should not be used on my baby and it was a miracle. The God I served, Jehovah, made it possible for Dr. Devananda, the surgeon, to perform the, the surgery and it was a success today. So I thank Manipa Hospital. They are doing a good job. So far their hospitality is wonderful. I have seen 99% success rate of their treatment, both from friends in Nigeria that I met and all over the world. They are actually doing a great job and I say they should keep it up.